Hey guys, today we're going to be fixing a problem with this outside outlet. Stay tuned. Okay guys, what we got here, we noticed that whenever we would plug something in on this outside outlet, that not only was it a little loose, the uh, it, it didn't want to work right. Like the blower or the, the this goes to uh, her water fountain over here. It wouldn't work. And we got to noticing in the bathroom, sometimes the fan and vanity light would work and sometimes it wouldn't. And then out back, whenever those wouldn't work, there's a receptacle out back. That wouldn't work so we got to think of once if you wiggle this everything else would work so I don't know why it's all tied into this one especially the one out back you think it would be tied into something right there in the, the kitchen but it's not so what we're going to do is we're going to see what the problem is here so I've already got the power shut off to this so Hope no creepy crawlies like big ass black widows come out at me or nothing. But let's see what we got going on here. <clears throat> so I'm guessing a broken wire or something. I'm not seeing any broken wires. I'm thinking this thing itself is just bad. It does have the ground. So let's take this ground off. Oh God, I hope we don't get bit by anything. So we have to replace this. I have one right here. Hope you guys are seeing this okay. Alright. Make sure that's right. Ugh, there goes a little tiny spider. I gotta grab something out of the house. My glasses. side here okay I'm reading this and make sure all right so it's gonna go like this just like this here nothing else is exposed hell this could be the original one from 1994 when the house was built Who knows? did you guys see the uh, monkey's video of some of her before and after photos of when she bought the house and what all has been done to it very interesting it was in very poor condition when she bought the house as far as foundation roof and all that was still great condition but the inside it had sent empty for five years and what happened was people kids had gotten in spray painted graffiti that's why you'll still see some graffiti there um, but it's not as bad as it was. I'm just going to yank this out since I'm not reusing it. It's 
supposed to be able to get a, I'm going to get a little tiny screwdriver and stick down in there if I can. Okay. So, but, um, the, uh, do I have one little enough? Sure, I've got some. But the, uh, yeah, the house sat empty for, it said, so, so the vandals come in. They, they, you know, like apparently stole a hot water tank and just graffitied the hell out of the place. So, she's done a lot of work on the house. See these inside here, there's a little tab you push and it releases that wire. So <clears throat> that's how you take them out. A little screwdriver, a little nail. I'm using a piece to my uh this is to my uh test light, so Come on, this one's not releasing. Of course, you can re you can cut them if you want and restrip them, but there we go. They should just pop right out, just like that. Now this first top one, I can see right there it's a little, and I messed up a little bit, so I'm thinking, and it came right out. It just pulled right direct, right out. So I'm guessing that was the problem. And then these are just going to stick right down in here. So, loosen them up. Like I said, it's old. So it's time to get a new one. Everybody had a great Easter. And I, now I didn't realize something. Yesterday was uh, I'm gonna clip a little bit of that off. Those are awful long. Yesterday was April Fool's Day. Now had I have remembered that, I would have had some fun videos for y'all. I did not remember it. So, I don't know why I'm telling you this, <laughs> but anyhow, I'm just going to clip those off, make them a little shorter. I don't like how much of that uh, copper is exposed, so. Alright. <clears throat> See, it's just awful, awful long, so I'm going to. I'll make them a little shorter. Make sure you don't go too short because it's got to make its connection there. So, there we go. All right, let's try that guy. There we go. That's better. Down in there, tighten her up. Whoops, sorry. Bunch of guys. that one number three and down in here and number four get it down in here and get him tightened up like that now 
we're going to do the ground. Let's straighten it out a little bit. Again. The ground is all, always goes on that green nut. Okay. So. had my coke all day long she says I need to cut down on drinking so much coke because of the way I've been feeling the past few days and um, so it's almost 1 30 in the afternoon so I haven't had a coke yet I've been drinking some water though I'm about to go get me one I guess she just cares about me guys so but been having some chest pains and real real weak and lightheaded and comes and goes. Been going on for all oh, week, week and a half now. Blood pressure. She checked my blood pressure yesterday. It's a little high, so I just like the one we did in the bathroom kinda Get it square as you can, so it doesn't look stupid. And then tighten these up. Don't want to go too tight because it'll just keep drawing it in. We'll try to get it centermost as possible. And try to straighten it out some. cover on here because it is an outside they say you should put a GFI in here but it's covered up so I do need to get I do have a one of the new gaskets in there somewhere but I don't know where it is right at the moment so what we're going to do we're going to go ahead and put this one on for now go all right guys I'm gonna plug the uh, see and then that foam just covers that up I'm gonna plug this in which I already did now I'm going to go in we're going to turn the power on and we'll know because I have I have the light and fan on in here let me sit you down here. Okay. Let me go turn it on and we'll know if it works. So we'll be right back. I'm in the garage. Alright. Flip it on. The light and fan should have came on and they did. So that's weird guys how they've got that hooked up. That's the first leg of it, apparently, because it goes to, from there into here and then out to the back, out here by this back door. I, I don't know. So, anyway, guys, there's another quick how-to thing. I know you've seen me do the bathroom ones, but just hit it again to make sure. You guys can do this stuff yourself. Just make sure the power is off. I have done it when the power was on before I think I told you that story. <laughs> Didn't realize I thought it was off. But, okay guys, so I'm going to get my tools and pretty nice day out here today. A little overcast, but see her fountain is running now. So. Alright, so there we go guys. Thanks for watching. Let me make sure I'm on the screen. Okay. Thanks for watching, guys. And as always, if 
uh, check out Monkey 1000. Check her channel out. Her last video was awesome. She's been planting some flowers. Um, she's got these to plant. She's going to plant down through here. These little flowers. And then she planted these herself. I drilled some holes in the bottom of the pan so it doesn't get up too much water. But they were like $7.50 a piece. So. And then I don't know what the flowers were, but that's what the pots were. So anyway, guys, again, check out Monkey 1000. Don't forget to check me out. The myth, the man, the legend, Shaburn 1000. All right, guys, I'm gone. Bye-bye now.